stormed a bridge linking Mexico to the United States in El Paso, Texas on Sunday. They were so desperate to enter Texas, you'd think they were Californians. <laughs> Videos detailing the chaos that unfolded, migrants of all ages charging forward, pouring in from all sides, trying to get into the land of freedom, opportunity, and pancakes. And not because they heard Greg was washing his car in jean shorts again. <laughs> Savings from Silicon Valley Bank. The situation got so chaotic, Customs and Border Protection had to beef up manpower on the U.S. side of the bridge, while the Mexican military tried to contain things on their side. It looked like the New York City Marathon, minus all the paperwork beforehand. She's <laughs> obesity problem, so she served up another word salad. Hit it, girl! We're going to move forward with a with a uh, with this kind of system, this immigration system that has been gutted, really, truly gutted by the last administration. We're going to move forward and do it in a humane way. We're going to do it in a safe way. Uh, and we're going to do it in the way that moves us forward. And so what we have been seeing, what we've been dealing with, again, is trying to fix the damage that the last administration do, did. Here's an actual video of the brain cells leaving her head during that statement. <laughs> For an editor, mm -hmm. <laughs> can you edit that statement? <laughs> I don't even know. I just want to say, too, like this idea of blaming Donald Trump. Uh -huh. The Trump administration was not perfect and it wasn't perfect on the border, mm -hmm. but they actually did get to the point where the border was somewhat under control. Yeah. And President Biden, like on day one, uh -huh. moved to tear down every protection. And now when things like this happen, they're like, why is this happening? We have no idea what's going on. Uh -huh. It's all dumb. them. No, that's the scam. You see, remember the old Chris Rock bit? where he talks about Robitussin. Mm 